MG Tracy today, Paul in London, and we're very excited today. It's going to be opening of the first five magazines from the fantastic Build Your Own 3D printer, Heartworks, as you may see from previous videos. We're great fans of the Heartworks collection, but I think really the idea that you can build your own 3D printer sort of takes this to another level. So uh, we're going to have a little go at looking quickly what's in the magazines um, and we'll put the first five pieces together and let you have a look at how it's going. And this is available by subscription, so I'll uh, show you the website in the links below. So here is issue one. So you can see the first bits of the printer. It's all quite heavy and well made. I won't spend too much time on issue one because there's a whole separate video I've shot on that. So again, I'll put the links below so if you want to have a good look at issue number one. Here's issue number two. Then we can make up the parts there that come with issue two. We'll just have a quick flick through there, shall we? So in this issue, V3 printer parts, Y shaft and fixing base, and also starting to do some of the downloads of the software, so if I can focus that in on you. Uh, the all important software, 3D modeling software that you want to get to grips with, so that when you've built your printer, you'll be really familiar with uh, the software that allows you to do your own thing. Skills for SketchUp, measure it out step by step. So here you can see all the tutorials that run through on some of the software. So 3D printing really I think is set to change our lives over the years ahead. I think from the ability to produce pretty much anything you want at home from your own phone case, that there's an iPhone protector there, to your own chest pieces, right through to commercial ones which I think really will eventually be at the point where you can print the parts, replacement parts from a car, to you can print extra bits for the human body. There we go, there are the parts in issue three. So let's uh, have a look at that now. So when you subscribe, you get uh, four or five issues all come together, batched up for you. So you can have a really good go at installing all the bits to ever have a good run at it. It's issue four, have a shaft there. Well made. Just showing you just how our industry uses 3D printing for almost every stage of the design of consumer products right through to cars. Some more information there on uh, teaching yourself the basics of 3D modeling software. About the filament so if you think about how you print at home with your ink cartridges when you're printing in 3d this is sort of your ink if this filament is what the printer melts from that state to build up your models so here we are here's our vector 3 y shaft and belt holder it's all very exciting so have a look at the last number five that comes in your first subscription pack screws and bits and pieces, so I'll have fun with those and then I'll put those together. And there we go, there's issue five. I'll show you what's coming with issue six. Or 
filming all the electronics. Excellent, so I'm going to have a go at whopping that all together and we'll show you what it looks like in a moment. Oh right, I've wandered through all the first five magazines and put them together so I'll show you what that looks like in a moment. Just one of the leaflets in there I found really interesting. The brief history of 3D printing. So the thing that really uh, struck me is this has been around a lot longer than I thought. So look, 1984 Charles Hull invents stereolithography, the process that first makes 3D printing possible. So, 2002, scientists print the first working kidney. Uh, isn't that absolutely amazing? 2008, first person walks using 3D printed prosthetic leg. 2009, first home 3D printers into the marketplace. The University of Southampton creates the world's first 3D printed robotic aircraft. This shows how quickly this technology caught on into so many areas. The world's first 3D printed car in 2011. <clears throat> and the other thing is, remember about 3D printing, you can actually print in lots of different materials. So in 2011, is that one I say? Mater Lease? Mater Lease becomes the world's first service to offer 3D printing in gold and silver. The first 3D printed prosthetic jaw Architects in Holland are on track to unveil the first 3D printed house. That's incredible, isn't it? And sort of now it's our turn. So let's have a look at uh, what it looks like after you've built the first five parts. So here, this is what you should have after you've uh, put the first uh, five issues parts together. You've got a, a drive belt there that's going to hook over a motor later on part of the carriage on the bottom. So what you can see is as, uh, as that turns, as that belt's going to turn there. So you can see, I think this will pull the table along eventually. And then the 3D image will be printed in plastic above it. So it's pretty heavy, it's pretty chunky. So we're looking forward now to the next batch of issues to do the next uh, phases of building our 3D printer. Please leave some comments below, we'd love to hear from you and have a look at the other Artworks videos. We'll see you next time. Cheerio for London.